What's good? What's good, everybody? Come on in. Double Bottle Entertainment making another video. Man, I tell you, you can't criticize Canelo Alvarez without the fans getting in your ass. And the thing about it, I like Cinnamon. You know what I mean? He's one of my favorite fighters, but it is what it is. I'm not scared to um, criticize nobody, let them know what they is. Man, his fans, I ain't had these many bad comments in a long time, but you know, I love it, man. Keep sending the bad comments. That shit don't bother me, man, because I'm going to speak facts, man. Y'all can suck his, you know what, and say he's the A side, B side, C side. It still don't make it right. I even said he's the A side. You know, he's the A side and all this, but man, uh, y'all going to be content with him fighting these dudes that um not that good or you want to see Canelo fight the best. Do you want to see Canelo Alvarez fight the best or you want to keep seeing him fight these guys that are not that good? That's all I'm saying. You know what I mean? So he can go fight Triple G for the third fight. And he, everybody knows Triple G is shot and he looking for one more payday. Everybody know that. Who the fuck want to see him fight the 39, 38-year-old guy? You know what I mean? It's done. That shit is over with. Who want to see him go up and fight a big, slow, um, butter beaver, or bit of bevel? You know what I mean? None of them have no skill. One of them might have some power and stuff like that. But that's it. That's all I'm saying, man. I want to see good fights. I want to see good fights. And um, that's all That's all I'm talking about, man. But since when you can't criticize um, the best, you know what I mean? The best supposed to fight the best. Yeah, he's the A-side. Y'all keep writing that shit in my comments all day till you die. But, you know, the A-side got to fight the best. I'm not saying he got to go sign a three-fight deal with Al Heyman, but, you know, but he need to go do something besides fight these bums. Y'all ain't talk that shit when he went and signed that two-fight deal with Matchroom. And he fought them two bums in Matchroom, but y'all didn't take, y'all ain't talk that shit then. But now all of a sudden, you know, because it's PBC, and Al Heyman, y'all don't want him to um, sign no two-fight deal. He a free agent. He could do what he want. Yeah, he is. He's a free agent. He could do whatever he want. We all know that. Yes, but um, are y'all, are y'all, <laughs> what is it, content for him fighting these trash cans, the Uber drivers, the Lyft drivers, and the Safeway workers and shit like that? Or you want to see him get challenged? Not saying these guys going to beat him. Not saying uh, Benavidez can beat him. Not saying Keller Plant can beat him. Not saying Charlo can beat him. I'm not saying none of that stuff. But what I am saying, they can give him better competition than Billy Joe Sonner, Jusuf, and all the rest of the Judum, and all the rest of the bums that he's been fighting. That's all I'm saying. They can give him better competition than Billy Joe Saunders and all the rest of these guys, man. Don't y'all want to see action-packed, great fights, man? I'm not going to go off on y'all today, man, because I see y'all ignorant. You know what I mean? And when you set in your ways, you're like an old motherfucking man. You're stuck and set in your ways. Stop being so fucking old and set in your ways and open your brain up to new ideas, man. And the new idea is for Canelo to fight better opponents. And if he don't fight better opponents, what we going to say about him? You know what I mean? Y'all keep, we can't say he's one of the best in this era if he's not fighting better opponents. Canelo Alvarez got to fight better quality opponents. You know what I mean? I'm going to root for him, you know what I mean? But not when he fight Shiloh and people like that. I'm not rooting for him then, you know what I mean? Because um, that, that's what I like Shiloh. Shiloh is my favorite fighter, him and Keith Thurman, you know what I mean? So, can, that's it is what it is, but... You know, I like Canelo. He doing his thing. You know, y'all still butt hurt because Mayweather schooled him when he was younger, whooped his ass. But a loss is a loss. You know what I mean? So, um, for school, forgive this video if it paused a little bit because it's raining like hell. So I decided to make the video when it was raining. So excuse the video, but y'all gotta open your brain, man. You gotta open your mind. You gotta be wise. It's, Get out that old, get out your feelings, stop being stuck up. Just open your mind a little bit. Wouldn't you want to see Canelo Alvarez fight Benavidez, you know what I mean, 68. Benavidez talk all that shit. He comes straight forward, you know what I mean. Got some pop, you know what I mean. Got speed, you know, got some pop with him. Wouldn't you want to see Canelo Alvarez get um, challenged? Wouldn't you want to see um, Canelo Alvarez fight, um... 
um, plant, Keller plant, you know what I mean? Even though Keller plant don't got no power, he reminded me of um, Laura. And Laura was the last person who really, really gave Canelo some, some, some problems. You know what I mean? Plant moves around the ring. He got that jab. You know what I mean? He's like an upgraded Billy Joe Saunders. <laughs> He's an upgraded Billy Joe Saunders, man. Don't y'all want to... Ain't y'all could um, intrigue with that kind of shit? Or y'all just critique about downplaying because um, Al Heyman and PBC. If that's what it is, get the fuck out of box. Stop watching boxing. Go go watch the Royal Grass or something. You know what I mean? Because the shit is just pathetic, man. And, um... Wouldn't you guys want to um, see um, Canelo fight Jam Jamal Charlo? Come on, man. Styles make fights. You know, even if Canelo beat him, he going to be there. He going to hit Canelo. Canelo ain't been hit. When he, when he been hit? When have Canelo? When the last time Canelo been hit and really challenged? The first and the first and second um, Triple G fight. That's the last time he really been hit. Danny Jacobs ain't really do shit. You know what I mean? But that's the last time he really been hit, you know what I mean, in Charlotte. Charlotte going to be right in the middle of that ring, moving around. Canelo going to be going to the body. Don't y'all want to see these exciting fights? Like I said, not saying these guys can beat him, but, you know, it will be exciting and good to watch him fight better quality opponents. And if you don't want to see him fight better quality opponents, you need to start watching uh, rugby or something. You're not a boxing fan. You're just a Canelo Alvarez fan. Yes, he's the A side. Let me say it again. Yes, he's the A side. Let me say it again. Yes, he's the A side. But what the fuck do it mean when you're not fighting quality opponents, man? Yeah, he has a level. He has a leverage and shit like that. So you ready for him to do one fight deals? You know what I mean? One fight deals with Matchroom or one fight deals with PBC? PBC just not going to um, serve him up um, Keller Plant like that. I can tell you that now because Al. Even though there would be um, Keller Plant biggest payday, Al Heyman could just say, "Okay, well, Keller, you know, I understand, you know, this be your biggest payday, ten million dollars and shit like that. But this is what I can do for you. I can serve you up Jamal Charlo, and if you beat that, then I can give you Benavidez. That's about fifteen. That's about fifteen, sixteen million right there. You know what I mean? And if you fight um, Charlo and so lose, that pay per view deal will get you at least seven million. You know what I mean? So, we can, and you're young. You're tw well, Keller Plant is young. I forgot how old he is. You're young, so you can continue fighting. One fight don't make a man. You know what I mean? It's a legacy fight if you beat Canelo, but, you know, the odds, to me, the odds is he's not going to beat Canelo. But Keller Plant don't look like no guy that's going to go around chasing nobody, begging for fights, kissing ass like the rest of these guys, like Triple G is doing, you know, and like Andrade is doing and shit like that. You know what I mean? So there's fights out there to be made, but it's, it just so happened it's on the PBC side, unless he want to move up to 75. But people is talking, everybody's saying, you know what I mean? Not me, not me, but it is suspicious. This guy come all the way from 140 and, and go up to 175 and knock these big dudes out. Which I forget now, WBC did raise the um, Clint Bruneval level a little bit for Canelo Alvarez. You think I'm lying? It's facts. Look it up. The WBC raised the Bruno Raw level for Canelo Alvarez. Why they do that? Hey, you got to ask them. Because this guy ain't no way in the world he can go out there and keep knocking these 175-pounders out with his little ass, man. You know what I mean? So something got to give. They need, not saying he's cheating, you know what I mean? But they need Vada in every championship fight. Vada Tesla need to be in every championship fight just to make sure everybody is playing on the same field. You know what I mean? That's just my opinion. That's just my opinion on that. I'm not saying Canelo is cheating, but, you know, some of the shit he's doing is just, you know, eye-popping and make you say, hmm. But, um, see, I'm calm. I'm not cursing this time because I seen all them comments y'all made. I just laughed at them, man. Y'all fanboys. Stop being a Canelo fanboy and be boxing. Go be boxing. Watch boxing. Love boxing and not love one fighter. Because if you can't, you know, determine um, that this man is fighting um, Uber and Lyft drivers. Let me show you the difference. You fight Uber or Lyft driver, right? Or you fighting, uh, let me see, Olympic medalist. 
You know what I mean? That I'm just saying, Uber Lyft drivers, them dudes ain't got no hardly no skill. At least Olympic medal has been in boxing and doing that damn thing. He can't keep fighting these guys, y'all. He just cannot be keep fighting these guys. So um, I'm just saying, man, Canelo, you got to put up and shut up, man. You know what I mean? Uh, I mean, he want payday, he want payday, yeah, all that shit, Andrade want to payday and all that shit, but, uh, you know, Andrade would give you a good fight, but I don't believe he can beat you, you know what I mean, but that's the thing about it, we want to see good fights as boxing fans, and if you don't want to see a good fight, stop commenting, you know what I mean, stop saying the A-side bullshit, it's just showing me that y'all really... It's just Canelo Alvarez fans and stuff like that, man. And if you want to talk about it, you see my hat, don't you? We talk about boxing shit on Friday. We talk about boxing on Saturday when I go live. We talk about boxing on Sunday. We talk about boxing on Monday. <laughs> hit, the, hit the subscribe button, man. <laughs> and subscribe and come on in. I won't cut you off, no. We can go back and forth. You can talk all that ignorant shit. I don't care because I can be ignorant too. I'm from Northeast D.C. So I can be ignorant as you can be. Man, so be respectful, you know what I mean? So um, come on in, if a bottle entertainment on YouTube, hit the like button. Y'all watch my videos and ain't hitting the like button. I, I, don't, I understand what, you know, y'all don't like what I'm saying, but facts is facts, man. Get out your fucking feelings. Get out your fucking feelings and let's make Canelo Alvarez great. He's not great. Not yet. He's there. But to push him over the top, he got to fight. Better quality competition. Or oh, people like they saying now, like Polly Molly Ogden and them and Teddy Adams, like, I don't know how he keep going up beating these big guys. You know what I mean? Y'all don't like that. But you know what I mean? Until he beat these better competition, I can't give him his due yet. Canelo is there. Canelo is a motherfucking he's the man right now. He's the A side, but you ain't gonna you gonna I'm gonna start putting you in that Terrence Crawford mode in a minute, Canelo. That ain't fighting nobody. You know what I mean? You keep fighting these slow Europe, Eastern European dudes that can't even, they can't punch and can't move and can't get your little ass off of them, man. So, how do I upgrade your fighters, man? So, the rebuttal entertainment, man. Hit the like button. You know what I mean? Hit the subscribe button. And um, you want to come in and shoot your shit? Come on in and shoot your shit. We'll shoot it back on you, man. So, um... Thanks for coming in. Talk to you guys later. Peace. You know I gotta give it to me. I'll give it to you. And I